Hey, what's up guys? The Flux here again. Welcome back to Men of War Assault Squad 2 and Born in the Fire America mod. Super excited to be back playing this mod and today we're not doing an American revolutionary scenario or anything else that went down during the late 18th century. We are here in the 1860s during the American Civil War. This is towards the end of the war and we've uh, marched pretty far down south. Uh, we are in Texas or Arizona. That is up to you to decide. And uh, we have here sort of a uh, Confederate regiment that is, um, well, they're they're not exactly eager to give up, even though the, the fight or in the war currently is a little bit futile. So, futile? Futile? That's what you call it, yes. So, I'm super excited to see how these guys are going to do defending. And this is not all of it. There are more troops spread throughout the map. We have some... Uh, companies deployed over here that are defending this sort of road junction and there's just a, there's a bridge here too which is really cool uh, that's epic this might be a pretty long battle anyway I'm very excited to see how it's gonna play out we have here sort of a, a railway line going down the center here's a ranch love the way this looks there's a sort of like very Red Dead Redemption I, I like it a lot and here's a quarry or a mine very cool. We'll see how all these locations throughout the map actually play a part. But first, we're going to witness the federal assault. We have two generals over here. We have a bunch of companies lined up and ready to assault. I do even believe we have some Union Marines over here standing by, ready to fight. Hey, he's having a smoke. He's, he's got his weapon shoulder. Maybe he's an NCO of some sorts. Who knows? But without further ado, let's click start and let's enjoy the battle. So, I presume... I don't think I need to do much right now. Just uh, wait for this show to start. Forwards! March! Dum, 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 dum. That's very cool. And we have two companies moving up here. We also have some... Are these Armstrong guns? Moving up to support. Currently, we can't even see the enemy from here. Their positions are... Uh, Starting to show there in the distance. Love these lines moving up. Dun, 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 dun. At the double, quick! So it's almost like we're running, jogging towards the enemy there to avoid more time in the open, more time being shot at. And I think the Confederates are just about ready to take aim and fire. They're all they're all holding and waiting for the final second to release the uh, volley, and it's on. Troops are more or less spreading out. The guns are moving up. We have the Marines and another regiment moving up on this side. Love the way this looks. It's really cool how they're m sort of marching in formation. The Confederates are coming down across the bridge in order to receive us. We also have some artillery on this side. This is going to be a really bloody battle. I swear there's like probably a good like 150 men to 200 men coming down this bridge now. They're going to be facing our marines and uh, other soldiers on this side. So that's going to be a bloody fight. They're just going to get intercepted. Union artillery back there supporting. Another gun is moving up. How's it looking here? The siege. The camp is... Oh, this gun is, I think, supposed to be on hold position. Something tells me it's not, which means it's gonna, if it's not on hold position, it's gonna more or less go right up to the enemy. So I'm gonna, well, we're gonna just, oh, the, well, uh, oh, not sure how to react to that, but this rabbit is far more interesting than that gun we just lost. Look, he's checking out this uh, Gatling gun crew, whatever this gun is, it's some sort of automatic weapon. Oh, look at the explosions back there. Whoa! So he did have a plan before he went down and, and died. Look at him, he's like struggling there. So they did knock out the Confederate uh, Gatling gun here of a sorts. Cute rabbit. I don't think the rabbit knows what to do. But uh, the struggle is real. The Confederates are still holding the camp here. Front line has been more or less shot down. It's up to the camp itself. This Union gun tried to go really far up here. No, that's a Confederate gun. 
Well, this Union gun is uh, successfully positioned, and I believe this gun is, if I'm not too wrong. Can I please look? There we go. Oh, it's on free move as well, so that might not have been the reason. That might not actually have been the reason why that gun moved up so far, so as far as I'm concerned, I'm still kind of a little bit clueless to that's why that happened. But look at these Confederates storming down now. They've, they've sent, like, several brigades across this bridge now. And I think we can move into that territory over here, but it's a little rugged. The terrain is a little hard to traverse. Yep. Let's call in some reinforcements that we have at our disposal. Let's call in some more line infantry regiments. I think we'll try and get some here to the railway. We also have a, our own kind of Gatling gun that's set up here and ready to go. That's very cool. Love the detail. It's a really nice gun, and the Marines back here, who were previously just holding the, the railroad, are now getting into the action as well. It's a very big battle out here in the west. These troops are pulling back. Over there we see some generous volleys. And over here, the, it's been a slaughter. The Confederates have absolutely gunned us down. I'm gonna go ahead and grab some confeds and crew the gun up there. Oh, it's destroyed. Well, that is so unfortunate because I really wanted to see more of that. But it looks like it's just gonna turn into a long range skirmish on this side for now. We have more troops moving in though, separately. And we have another line regiment that is more or less combined here with these Marines. Jeez. Artillery opening up. It's getting very bloody indeed. Let's call in more of these troops while we can. I'm going to wait three, two seconds and then call in some here on the left side as well. We need to bring down that fort, or the camp rather, which is so heavily defended. We would need more artillery. Question is, is this gun act... Oh, there's two rabbits by the, the gun now. Well, that's cute. So far, they're they're alive and well. No more Confederate forces are moving across the bridge. I think they've more or less exhausted all their forces in the area. They've committed them all to pushing us back. Look at the amount of dead Marines here littering the field. And then there's just a collection of dead troops here in, a, in a, what I believe is a state flag of Texas. With the big star, the lone star. Look at this. Now this is a collection of federal infantry. A large and vast collection, all moving in. Right now it's a battle for the railway. And it's a fierce one. Very fierce. So much fire, you'd, you'd think there was friendly fire, but so far I think everyone's doing okay. Can I grab this commander? Jeez. Right ahead. Look at him. That's epic. Can he fight? Will he go into melee? Oh, I think he will. This is a very daring task, Commander. What are you doing? He's leading the troops. That's what he's doing. He's gathering morale. He's oop. He's running around. He's trying to show the way. Okay, I think it's about time I take command just briefly. Time to arrange the assault on the camp. The camp is our main objective. That's where they're that's where they're primarily held up. So we need to further the assault on that place. And just continue advancing and moving up. The troops flanking us on our right, they're important to keep back. And I think we can do so. We've fought them back over here. They're actually gradually retreating. This is just, by the way, one big mess. And this Gatling gun, I need you to move up to the railroad. Oh my lord. It's a laggy, laggy battle. A lot of forces involved. Sometimes more isn't the merrier. Some, well, the more the merrier sometimes, but usually less is more. So if less is more, then more is merrier, and more is less. You get it? Yeah. 
I think we're starting to get an idea now. The lag seems to get better if I remove my ability to command the troops. But a vast charge like this is what we're going to need to push the Confederates back. And I think we need to stop sitting by the rocks here. We don't want to be any rock huggers. That's up to Greenpeace and all that stuff. We'll, uh, we'll send our infantry forward. Look at the general on his horse. Forwards! Pushing the Confederates back here to the uh, foot of the hill. They have artillery back there, so they will they will be supported. But we are putting some serious fire on them now. They're, they're being pushed back. They pushed us back primarily at a start, but now we're sending them back. Backpacking, boss. Ever wanted to go backpacking? <laughs> well, they're backpacking. <laughs> yeah, okay. Out of range, primarily. This thing is not the most ranged of units, but... Uh, it's an epic unit. It's cool. I like it. How's it looking on this side? We have a few brave souls trying to further the attack. Look at them kind of moving up here and kind of trying. I will not see Union lives go wasted so dearly. So carelessly. We must reinforce. We must send more forces to the left flank. I'm thinking... You must continue assaulting. We'll send up the whole platoon. Oh no. Malfunction. But he can do it. He can do it on his own. Look at that. Spin it, boy. There we go. Marines flank around the right flank. The rest of the battalion will attack the hill. Look at these Marines going in, man. First to fight. It's a mix now of Marines and regulars. I wonder if the Marines got here by boat. Maybe the coast of Texas, you know, around Florida. Landed in the south. Very possible. Very possible indeed. Taking way more fire now already. This gun has been knocked out. We've lost some of the war machinery here, but um, we're doing good. We're going to continue pushing. The closer we get to the artillery, the, the more likely we are to take it out. It's epic. Have I exhausted all my... No, I have not. I have not exhausted all my resources. Or have I? I believe I... I believe we're out of reinforcements now, so this... Hmm. I th thought I had the points remaining, but... Uh, Maybe there was a timer on it, or there was a limit. Perhaps there was more of a limit than the score. I think there was only really a certain amount you could get. We must continue to push and to try and take this fort. This is the this is the main objective. Here we go. We're starting to knock them out. They're 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 taking fire back there too. Do we have any artillery that's active? Well, get on the guns. God damn it. Nice. Shoot him up. Shoot him up. What? What? What's? See, that's not gonna work. Oh, you hit something further back there, but I ain't. I'm not gonna hate you for it. Turn the gun around. Get more reinforcements up here. This is freaking epic. Need more troops. We've pushed them back to the hill now. I think we can relieve a lot of these forces here on this side. It's kind of an even fight. This is what I'm this is when it gets really interesting. When I'm like forced to take a lot of these units and push them to the left side now. Charge up close, boys! We're being shot at by artillery. We're getting closer. It's such an epic siege. Forwards! Ooh, 
huge explosion at the back. Confederates are holding their camp. Sir, we're starting to run low on reinforcements. God damn it, we didn't come all the way out. I would get our ass kicked. Commit everything we have. Everyone. Everyone. Yeah, we've more or less completely secured that. So I'm going to call it a retreat on this side. Pull back, pull back. The Confederates can follow us if they want to. But so far, it is not worth continuing that fight over there. We've taken out their artillery. We've pushed back. <coughs> Sorry about that. We'll leave a squad of men here to kind of push them back even further. Have some retreated on the bridges. There's just a few here by the quarry, but... Look at that rabbit. It has no idea what to do. Marines! We'll set the tempo. These damn Confederates are still alive. move up far on the right flank there let's get troops like really close he's he climbed the rock that's ingenuity right there there we go blown to smithereens boys there we go what was that there was another gun firing but from where Call in the flag carriers too for extra morale support. We need everyone we can get back over there, boys. Let's bring this gun up too. We're trying to hold up our firing line here. We have a mortar of some sort or, or something. I, I can't really precisely tell what it is, but we have something that's dropping shells. Do we have a mortar somewhere back here? There's a hold section over there. There we go. Aim at those guys. This is a bloody epic charge. We got our, some pistoliers here too. Look at our flagmen. They got a keys, man. Oh, that was something. I have no idea what that would be. And now, Jesus Christ. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, I can't answer this. Someone's calling me. Damn, sorry about that. I don't know. I never have Facebook open on my computer. But... Damn it, stop writing, please. How am I supposed to use some mind mind power here, mind reading, and, and tell the person to stop? Fire is still continuing over here. Let's nail that flag carrier back there. Sorry about that. It's pretty epic. Right, boys! Charge! Marines throwing hand grenades of some sorts. Look at this guy. An NCO. Killed him. Did they kill him? He's alive. Yeah. He, they killed him. He's dying. This is a really close fight. Really, really cool to be able to control the enemy or the some of the troopers like this. Both sides are taking a lot of casualties early on, like, or late on like this. There's even a few alive. Oh, there's at least one guy here with a pistol. Oh, he's... he's get, Oh, kill him! Kill him! Knock him down! Oh, that was bloody. That was bloody. I think... Did we do it? There's still some... 
Confederates down here are counterattacking. What? Did we really have this many? S so we did have some reinforcements back here. I just noticed that using the the, uh, the, the game, obviously. Let's counterattack towards the center here. Let's bring up all our forces. Let's take these men over here. Counterattack this way and we'll pinch the uh, the besiegers. They're currently ones that are trying to surround us now. We need a f I need a few men over here to not a few. I'm getting a handful now, but there's a there's there's a general alive over here. That was a, a hor horrible execution with a pretty pretty heavy caliber bullet to the back of his head. Look at this guy. He's just standing up. He's like, "Oh, my lady," bending forward. Anyway, what an absolute epic fight it's been a long one it's been a bloody one look at all the casualties the yellow will be confederates the union will be red oh my lord it's been a slaughter of both sides here and look at the the bloodshed here in the camp if you guys enjoyed this battle and want to see more civil war american revolutionary stuff and whatnot then let me know and we can make th these are on a whole different kind of epic than the regular world war ii battles and whatnot hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you guys soon again